hi guys it's George from Cyprus Insight today we're in Limassol in this quaint little area where they've got lovely old houses and a lot of them have been restored and we're going down to the restaurant so we're going to walk down these narrow roads which way do you think it is down here oh you've got a map on your little phone excellent See look, they've all been restored. Well, most of them have. There's an old oven there. Look at that one. There's lots and lots of restoration work going on. There's a lovely old traditional oven there. I think that was for baking bread. That's not for the Gleftigo. That's not a Gleftigo oven. Right, let's go down here, shall we? Okay guys, let's go down there. Now we're staying at Nikki's house at bookings.com. Look out for the video. Oh look, there's even a library. Right, which way we got to go? Okay, okay. So we got a little bit lost guys and we've ended up here. We don't really know somewhere in Limassol and it's a Lebanese restaurant. Right, let's have a look at the menu. So there's a lovely menu. Oh look, you can have a messe if you like, 25 euros a person. There's the salads guys. And you can make up your own messe if you like. The salads are around 10 and 12 euros. There's lots of variety there. Let's pick one out. Let's have a village salad, chicken salad. And let's carry on. Well, now these are the bits and pieces that you can pick out. They're all around five euros. The hummus, lentils. Oh, aubergines, that's nice. There's the tahini. Oh, lots of different Lebanese food there. Looks all delish. And I like the fact that you've got pictures. Lots and lots of dishes to choose from. As I said, they're mostly five and six euros, guys. Oh, they're Scoobies as well. Look at that. Which is a traditional Cypriot dish, also Lebanese. Right, let's turn the page. This is the hot section. There we are, lots and lots of stuff, including chips, by the way. You can have chips. Alumi there, that's seven euros. There's fish dishes as well. There's some spaghetti dishes. From the grill, there's lots of things to choose from. Now these are whole dish, guys. You get your chips and your sides and your salads. And we've been recommended the chicken, the chicken kebab, but marinated. There we are. That's the marinated chicken kebab with lovely Lebanese spices. There are lots of things from the grill, including a pork chop at 16 euros, or the chef de yes. There we are, and we've got like a flat pita bread meal. There is desserts if you fancy some desserts. I don't think we can have desserts. It looks like a lot of food, but there's lots of different desserts you can have, and they're around about five euros. There's tea and coffee, and uh, a slow beer. So there we are, that's our Lebanese restaurant, guys. Found by accident as we got lost in Limassol. Look at that, we've got a lovely salad to start and some pita bread. Oh, wow. Oi, oi, oi. Just a stolen one of those crispy things off the top. 
Is it delish? Oh, double delish. Look at these lovely pita breads, guys. They're in a polythene bag and they're lovely and moist and warm. That salad looks delish. When it laid out lovely, look at that, it smells delish. Now there's the salad and we've got these lovely chips. There's some moist pita bread. Well, let's tuck in. Oh look, we found the restaurant on the internet. It's on John F. Kennedy Road. And there's the outside. And it was really delish, guys. Double delish. There we are, guys. There's a bar across the road. Looks like uh, some football's going on tonight. And there's a lovely Lebanese restaurant. Lovely food, double delish. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And if there's somewhere you'd like me to go, put it in the comments below.